Hey everyone, we're back, Bean and Bagel. If you're not familiar with our channel, we review food and we do various fun things occasionally. <laughs> um, today we are at Pizza Hut and we're doing the Spicy Lovers and we have the pepperoni version. So this is a limited time only item. So you'll have to do your research to see how long it's available in your area. Uh, we kind of approach these limited time items as a way to give feedback uh, in general and also to the company. Uh, just because it's limited time, it allows uh, us to provide feedback to them to say, hey, you know, we think you should continue this or, you know, you can just let this go because it's not that good. Uh, just as a consumer and giving feedback. So it's also uh, to let the viewers know if it is available in your area, whether you might want to check it out based on our opinion. And that's our approach. So I'm looking forward to it. I like yeah. pizza. I like Pizza Hut. I got a lot of memories with Pizza Hut growing up <laughs> and going in the restaurant. And then the buffet, man. I used to love going to lunch. Uh, to the Pizza Hut buffet. I miss the restaurants, I'll say that. I'm not a huge fan of the express versions, but if you could bring the restaurants back, that would be fantastic, but I understand we're in a new age and everything's different. So blah, 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 blah. Let's eat the pizza. That's all you care about anyway. That's all <laughs> I really want to do. Also, even though I'm still blabbing on. Yeah, this pizza's getting cold. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Okay, well, why don't you try it? And so this is the Spicy Lover's Pepperoni. This has sliced red chilies, spicy marinara, and fiery flakes. Mm. Is it too hot? No. It's uh, first bite, definitely you get the spice. It, you, you taste like the um, spicy flakes and um, you get a little heat on your, on your lips. Mm-hmm. It's a little greasy, I'll say that, but it's not terrible. You can see underneath the bottom there, it's not like soaked or anything. Mm. But, um. Mm. That's good. Yeah, it, uh, I like the spice with it so far. Mm -hmm. This is also the pan version. So we got the pan pizza. Huh. I was gonna say, it's pretty thick. Mm -hmm. It's good. I haven't had Pizza Hut pan pizza in I don't know how long. The heat's starting to kick in for me, man. Is it? It's not like, oh my gosh, my mouth's on fire, but it's warming up. Yeah, you do feel it building a little bit. I like it though. Like, I think it works really well with a pepperoni. Mm -hmm. And pan pizza can be like kind of heavy. So having the spice kind of really just brightens it up. I like um, spicy pizza personally. Mm -hmm. I think sometimes pepperoni in and of itself is really good, but it can also sometimes be, eh, you know? So when you add some spice to it, it livens it up. Mm -hmm. If I were to give my opinion about it, I would say um, Pizza Hut, keep this going. Don't make this limited time. I would yeah. buy this again. I would and, for sure uh, buy it again. Yeah, and if it's available in your area as a viewer, totally recommend you give this a try if you like uh, spicy foods mm -hmm. and you like pizza. Yeah, they also have a spicy Hawaiian and a spicy veggie version. So, um, yeah, I, I really like this one though. Pizza Hut dates back a long ways. I'm sure like a lot of people nowadays probably associate other pizza chains as their favorites or whatever. Totally mm -hmm. understandable. But Pizza Hut, man, they had a say in a lot of stuff that you see nowadays, uh, even with modern pizza, like stuffed crust and all those kind of things. A lot of that stuff started, in, from my understanding, with Pizza Hut. And um, yeah, a lot of the pizza places you see today may not be what they are had Pizza Hut not existed, in my That's opinion. That's true, yeah. Well, I think for me, this is a definite try it. If, like like we said, you know, if you can find it in your area, go check it out. Um, it's limited time. We don't know how long it'll be out there, but mm -hmm. I'll come back. Um, kind of a 
fun note, I guess you could say too. From my understanding, Pizza Hut started on a college campus. They bought this small little store or whatever, and they had a sign that was available to them, and they could only put so many letters on it. And so they fit the word pizza, obviously, but then they had three letters left over and they didn't know what to do with it and it was gonna look weird on their sign if they just left it blank. So they're like, hut. <laughs> so from my understanding, that's how they came up with their name. So it's kind of funny. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I would recommend you try it. Yeah. That's my take. For sure, I like it. I think it adds a lot to just your typical pepperoni pizza and it's not like, so fiery hot that you're gonna like not enjoy eating it so mm -hmm. I think it's a try it it's a win so Pizza Hut we really think you should keep this one around and if you have the chance to try it and you can find it in your area go check it out other than that thanks for watching we'll see you next time have a great day bye peace out